Hey guys, and today I'm going to do something uh, unique. Today I've never done this before, and I haven't seen anybody else do this on their channels or videos. Uh, at least not yet. I'm sure it's probably out there, but um, I want to try something new here. Instead of just showing you my gold, I want to do a close examination of my gold, and maybe I'll do even more videos on silver coins and stuff. So um, we're going to start here with this uh, Elizabeth $10 Maple Leaf 1997. It's got a mirror finish head. And there's the uh, backing there, fine gold, one fourth of an ounce. So um, hopefully someday I'll have a one ounce, or maybe even half ounce. All right, so let's get started here. So we're gonna go up to the head, and you can see there's Queen Elizabeth, mirror finish with her crown, necklace, and earrings, and uh, has real nice sharp edges, and. Um, it's really amazing how the mirror finish of the head contrast with the dullness color of the sidebar. And uh, let's take a look at the millings. Here, let's uh, do this. On this coin, the millings are very sharp. This is because it's the new strike. Uh, well, actually, it's 1997. It's pretty old, but I think it's a uh, MS. So, you know, let's take a look at the back. There's a maple leaf, and um, and it's actually a mirror finish. The whole thing on the back. 999, 9 Canada. Fine gold, one fourth of an ounce, or P U R, pure, I'm guessing. You got the maple leaf there of Canada. And, um, yeah, it's pretty nice. So let's take a look at the American Eagle now. Let's put that to the side. Here's the one-fourth of an ounce American Eagle. Let's take a close examination of the, uh, Lady Liberty. Um, she's walking on rock with sandals. And there's the Capitol building in the side left with this, all the stars around it. She's got the, uh, branch her torch, the sun is rising in the background, 2011, and um, she looks great. Let's take a look at the back. In the back, we have an eagle landing in a nest. Focus here. United States of America, eagle landing, Torbosunum, one fourth of an ounce. You have an Emmy there and a JW. I'm guessing those are the designers. I am not entirely sure on that one. And um, one fourth of an ounce fine gold, ten dollars. This is an actually this is actually a 22, 22 carat uh, coin compared to the uh, Canadian maple leaf um, that is a 24 carat. And if you set them next to each other, um, you can see a slight difference in the color compared to them and uh, the 24 karat has a more of a gold look to it. But this is a little bit smaller and it's thicker. This is a larger and it's thinner. So they're about $438 right now. And uh, each right now or today, you know, uh, gold is at 160, one, uh, 1623, 1622. Silver is down today. And uh, here I'm going to take a look at my, doing a little examination, quick examination on this little tiny bar if I can get it out of this little cup thing there you go this is actually a 5 grain 999 fine 24 karat gold it's extremely th thin I mean I could bend this e ex so easily um, got this off eBay for about 20 bucks it's worth about 17 spot so I just got it because it's kind of a novelty but then again gold is not a novelty 5 grain, 999, 24 karat gold. And um, look at the back. It's so thin, you can even see an imprint of the actual stamping. But this is true. Gold can be stamped so thin that it can uh, be transparent. And you can take a one ounce coin and stamp it so hard to where it can stretch a football field. So it's pretty amazing. And, uh, that's why it's my favorite metal. And if you like this, and just hit like, and I'll make more videos of silver coins and 
You can request request any coin you want me to do, and I'll do it if I have it. And if not, I will try to get it, and then I'll do it. Um, comment, rate, subscribe. Um, just check out all my videos. I'll be updating. I'll probably get another one of these in a couple months. I'm positive of it, probably. And, um, yeah, positive. And uh, thanks.